now I'm like, how did we ever do that without co-producing it? How did we ever do that without w- directly working alongside academics, social workers, people with lived experience who would be, they'd be part of that equation in terms of a, st- a staff member from a regulator going out with their social worker? In what ways would it impact that relationship? In what ways would people feel able to say no? In what ways would that look like and be managed on the ground? Um, how would it how would it be managed with social workers in terms of them feeling an extra responsibility? What could we do to make that work better or I, identify when it wasn't going to work based on what people would say? I think these are questions that we might have asked, but that we wouldn't have been able to answer. So it was much more reflecting back now on what I was doing at the time. It, there was m- m- many more assumptions and stabbing in the dark and taking an educated guess and kind of thinking, well, we'll correct it kind of like as we go. But that getting it right the first time, I now feel more confident in the way that we would do it now to co-produce it, that it'd be much more likely to be correct the first time and that people would have better experiences from the outset. 